This is the discriminant. b squared minus 4ac. The equation becomes far more complex for polynomials with a degree larger than 2. So for now, we will focus on using the discriminant with polynomials with a degree of 2. The discriminant is notated by the Greek letter delta, which is pretty much just a triangle. At its core, the discriminant tells us the nature of the roots. That means that the discriminant tells us whether or not a quadratic has either 1, 2, or no real roots. Now that we know the equation to the discriminant and what it tells us, let's apply it to some problems. Find the number of real roots in the quadratic 7x squared plus 4x minus 9. Firstly, we have to remember our equation, b squared minus 4ac. This equation specifically tells us how many real roots are in the equation. Doing the math, we calculate that the discriminant equals 268. But what exactly does this tell us? Basically, whenever the discriminant is greater than 0, the equation has two real roots. Whenever the discriminant equals 0, the equation only has one real root. And finally, when the discriminant is less than 0, the equation has no real roots. Therefore, we know that the quadratic 7x squared plus 4x minus 9 has two real roots. Let's try this next problem. Given that x squared plus bx plus 9 has one real root, find all the possible values of b. Remember how the discriminant equals 0 when there is one real root? Well, we can set the discriminant equal to 0 and then solve for b. Doing some algebra, we get that b squared equals 36, meaning that b equals plus or minus 6. Plugging in both values into the equation, we get two values that get us an equation with only one real root. Hence, solving the problem.